Hello, welcome to GTEC Techno Solution Private Limited. We are going to discuss about wireless communication. What is wireless communication? Wireless communication is the transfer of information between two or more points that are not connected by any physical medium. These questions are highlighted in Bell and Tech Mahindra. Wireless communications can be via radio communication, microwave communication, light, visible and infrared communication. What do you mean by frequency reuse? Each cellular base station is allocated a group of radio channels to be used. So these radio channels can be used by another base station which is at a suitable distance away from it. This is known as frequency reuse. These questions are highlighted in IBM and LG interviews. What do you mean by handoff? When a mobile moves into a different cell while a conversation is in progress, the mobile switching center automatically transfers the call to a new channel belonging to the base station, that is your new base station. So that is known as handoff. What is mobile station subsystem? So if you see mobile station subsystem is a mobile equipment which refers to a physical terminal such as telephone and it includes a radio transceiver and a signal processor and a subscriber identity module which is nothing but your SIM card. So these things combined to form a mobile station subsystem. These questions are asked in Sony and Lenovo interviews. What do you mean by base station subsystem? Base station subsystem or BSS in short form is a section of traditional cellular telephone network which is responsible for handling traffic and signaling between a mobile phone and the network switching subsystem. So this acts as a mediator between your telephone and the network switching subsystem. If you are aspiring enough to be in IBM and LG, please concentrate on these questions. What do you mean by ad hoc networks? Ad hoc networks are those wireless local area networks or LAN that do not require any infrastructure to work. They can directly communicate with other nodes. So, no access point in particular will be required for that. Features of ad hoc network are as follows. It has high complexity and it has the greatest possible flexibility. Since it doesn't have an infrastructure, it is highly flexible and it has high complex algorithms used in order to communicate. What are the different types of transmission impairment? If you see, the received signal is not as same as the transmitted signal in certain cases. Then it is known as transmission impairment. So, your transmitted signal and received signal will be different. If 
this is the case then you say that there is a transmission impairment there are three different types of transmission impairment it is attenuation noise and delayed distortion what is the difference between 3g and 4g 3g stands for third generation as it is just that in terms of evolutionary path of mobile phone industry 4g means fourth generation that is a set of standard that is being developed as a future successor of 3g see the speed in 4G will be higher than 3G as well as your bandwidth will be higher in 4G than 3G 3G uses a technique known as circuit switching whereas your 4G uses even a faster technique of packet switching so this makes 4G faster what is blocked call clear system or bcc in abbreviation these questions are asked in sony hp interviews in a system a user is blocked without access by a system when no channels are available in the system so that is known as call blocked and the call blocked in the system is cleared and the user should try again What is meant by cell splitting? Cell splitting is the process of subdividing congested cells into smaller cells, each with its own base stations and the corresponding reduction in antenna height and transmission power. This will increase the capacity of cellular system. So here if you see you can reduce this congested cells into smaller cells as these by varying the height of the antenna and the transmitted power so this increases the capacity of your cellular system which enables us for a faster communication what is meant by multiple access techniques There are three multiple access techniques: frequency division multiple access or FDMA in abbreviation, time division multiple access or TDMA, code division multiple access or CDMA. So these are the three multiple access technique which can be used for accessing a bandwidth. What is meant by frequency division multiple access technique? Frequency division multiple access technique or FDMA is a channel access method used in multiple access protocols such as channelization protocol. FDMA gives the user an individual allocation of one of the several frequencies or channels. so if there are n number of frequencies we are giving a user a particular range of frequency within which he can use for communication so the frequency is allocated for a particular user alone exclusively and that is known as frequency division multiple access technique or fdma what is meant by time division multiple access technique Time division multiple access systems divide the radio spectrum into various time slots and each slot only one user is allowed either to transmit or receive so here you're dividing your time slot for each users so during that particular time slot only a single user can communicate so 
that particular time slot is exclusively allocated for that particular user to communicate. These questions are frequently asked in HR of Tech Mahendra. What is Code Division Multiple Access Technique? Code Division Multiple Access Technique or CDMA in abbreviation is nothing but a channel access method used by various radio communication technologies. Here, several transmitters can send the information simultaneously over a large communication channel, which is a single communication channel, and this allows several users to share a band of frequencies. So, in a particular range of frequency, we can allow more than one user to use the single communication channel because the code is differentiated rather than the frequency. Here if you see the purple code goes on and your green color code is also transmitted in the same bandwidth but they are different. What is meant by fast and slow frequency hopping? If the rate of change of the carrier frequency is greater than the symbol rate. Then we can say that the system is referred to as fast frequency hopping. If the rate of change of the carrier frequency is lesser than the symbol rate, then the system is referred to as slow frequency hopping. So these two relations can define your fast and slow frequency hopping. If your carrier frequency is greater than your symbol rate, then it is a fast frequency hopping. Whereas if your carrier frequency is lesser than symbol rate, then it is slow frequency hopping. What is meant by quadrature phase shift keying? or QPSK in abbreviation. These questions are highlighted and asked in VideoCon and Dell interviews. Quadrature phase shift keying or QPSK is a form of phase shift keying in which two bits are modulated at once. Selecting one of four possible carrier phase shifts, we have four phase shifts, which is nothing but 0, 90, 180 and 270 degrees. So, our phase is shifted one among the four, four phase shifts. QPSK allows the signal to carry out twice as much as information than ordinary PSK. PSK is nothing but phase shift gain using the same bandwidth. So we can carry twice as much as information. What is Gaussian minimum shift keying or GMSK? Gaussian minimum shift keying or Gaussian filtered minimum shift keying GMSK, the form of modulation with no phase discontinuities used to provide data transmission with efficient spectrum usage. You don't have any phase discontinuities to provide data transmission. So this provides an efficient spectrum usage as it is continuous. What is meant by Bluetooth? Bluetooth is an open specification for short range wireless voice and data communication and that was originally developed for cable replacement in personal area networking to operate all over the world. So our Bluetooth creates a personal area network and it is used for short range wireless voice. 